Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Roxanne. Today we are going to be doing a little bit different today. Sorry, I'm just trying to remember what I have and what I don't have. Okay, so today is going to be a get ready, <coughs> excuse me, and a review. Plus I'm going to show you what I got for my naughty knickers. So this is going to be a whole bunch of everything. And I am super excited because Today, I have decided to play with Barbie. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, I kind of went <clears throat> crazy about all that I could. Um, there were some things I didn't get. Um, I didn't get the mascara, uh, only because I do have so much mascara, but I might go back and get it. I'm kind of regretting that now. All right, so let's get ready, and I'm going to review everything with you. I was trying to... So that makes a whole lot of sense, right? Um, Okay, so I bought this about a week ago and I haven't opened it. I know. Okay, so I got everything I, I needed from shoppers. Okay, here we go. Um, so in this, there's a powder brush, a cheek brush, a fluffy, fluffy eyeshadow blending, eyeshadow packer, and an angled liner. Um, so I ended up getting this and the highlighter a week ago. And then I went back today and I got the eye the eyeshadow. Yes, the eyeshadow palette. Okay, the eyeshadow palette and one lipstick. Paid for those. Had a hundred thousand points which is about a hundred dollars and of course I cashed those in and got the blush palette I got the uh, two lip glosses that they had and the other lipstick so I am missing one lipstick one lip gloss Why do we always put these in like weird? Okay, one lip gloss. I am missing the three uh, nail polishes, the lip mist, which I really want, one kabuki brush, and um, yeah, and a few other things. I will find them. These are gorgeous. Look at the design on them, guys. Like, look. Isn't that gorgeous? They're soft. Okay. So, and I mean, the case is just beautiful. Okay. So, I'm going to start by using my It Cosmetics. We're going to kind of go out today. And now I've already been out, which kind of sucks. But that's okay. So as you guys know, this is one of my favorite um, bases that I've had to use. Oh, thank you. Okay, so I'm going to use my under eye stuff. I still have sparkles, I believe, from yesterday's fiasco. And it wasn't even the eyeshadow palette. It was the fiasco that I created. Okay, so one of the things I have picked up is there's a lot of people that will take this and they'll put it all over their face. And then I've seen other people say that it's way too much product, you're wasting a lot. So one thing I have heard is that to put it on the back of your hand and use that as your palette, right? So just, you know, dip on what you need and then go back and get more. So you're not wasting product on your face and you're not 
you know, overdoing it. So, and I like doing it that way because then I know my cold sore is finally healing up. Oh, okay. I am using the pure brush today instead of the It Cosmetics because this one here is also another one of my favorite brushes. You can actually get this at Shoppers Drug Mart right now. I actually don't know the price of it. I got this in one of my mystery boxes from Pure. And I have to say, like, this is still available on their website. So they don't always offload in their mystery boxes, like things that don't sell because obviously that's a really really nice brush and if it's not selling it's just because people are just you know not knowing what a great brush it is. Going in with my Lexi sponge with the It Cosmetics and Bye Bye Under Eye. So, so this is not available online through Shoppers Drug Mart yet. Um, I do keep checking the site. Trust me. I have been obsessively checking it. It is some stuff is available in store now when I was talking to the lady at Shopper she had just got back and she said she's having a hard time getting anything from pure so We could possibly not see the rest of the collection here, which really sucks Unless we purchase it from pure's website. It is at Ulta it looks like Alta has maybe the same things as Shopper. I didn't really check into it a whole lot. Um, I think I'm going to use... I do have other setting powders that I kind of need to use. Actually, we're going to use the Too Faced today. Because I've got that open, so I might as well use it. So there is um, eyelashes, and I was looking at them, and I'm like, huh, why didn't I just pick them up? Like, why? The eyelashes are cute, so maybe I'll go back and get them. I don't know. So I am. Whoop! I think I'm gonna. Oh, like that. I got it all over my phone. I'm gonna use my powder brush for this. Okay. So I am using the Too Faced that I got a couple boxes ago okay so I have a lot to talk about in this so I hope you guys like have your drinks ready because I've got a lot to unpack in this show yesterday I thought was a really really bad video a really um not on derma blends and I just need to work with the product a bit more. So I am going to try it again. I really wanted to take it back because I'm like, this is just not me. But the product is hard because it's made for professionals. It's not made for somebody who's just, you know, um, getting back into it. Now, with it being said, um, I got some comments back. I haven't really gone through the video. I've been busy. Um, cranky and then I got a message at the end of the day from Jennifer uh, yeah, so she made my evening just by contacting me um, okay so with that being said while this is setting I'll talk okay so BoxyCharm has not set my BoxyLux so I did sign up for it and I have not heard anything about it. Okay, so I don't know what's going on there. I'm not the only one. Now, I did sign up for it on the 1st, and it should have been shipped out by now, but it's not. I am not contacting them because I'm just going to get the rigmarole. 
I am sure lots of people have already contacted them and I will hear from them what is going on. I do know that COVID is hitting them down there pretty hard. So I'm going to try not to be part of that group that's, you know, harass uh, not harassing them, but are asking where the stuff is. The other thing is I want to say is that Tribe's Choice was yesterday. Okay, guys, I was by my phone. I was waiting. I wanted that LA Splash. Um... I got powder all over my phone. So I wanted that LA Splash Halloween palette. I was on right at seven o'clock. Okay, I mean, I was refreshing, refreshing, refreshing. Seven o'clock, okay. So then it asks for your email, which my phone automatically will fill out if I hit the right buttons, right? So it says, what email? And I have two email. I have uh, one that I use predominantly for things and a second one that I often will give out when I need notifications for it. Um, because my one email doesn't pop up and say, you have a new email, right? So anyway, so I had that filled in and then it asked me for my order number. And I was like, crap. So switched over to my email, searched through the first, cause it got charged on the 16th. So I had to go back to the 16th on this email, grab my order number, put it in to my palette came up. So LA Splash or the Pure Defense. I chose the LA Splash choose the chose choose chose the fair for the Gerard cosmetics clicked out you know they said great thank you you'll get an email so I got an email at 702 702 I did not get the LA splash Halloween palette that's how quickly it sold out now I went on to Instagram and I'm like, this is crazy, guys. So I put up the thing saying, like, right now you can still get the Pure Defense, which is still a great palette. Not going to lie. It looks like a nice palette. Um, it does have some Halloween colors in it, I think. But I wanted to do, like, a Halloween look. I don't know what kind of look I would do, but hey. So anyway. So Belly put that, uh, the owner of Tribe, she put you guys, we had the same amount of each and we're already, we were sold out within a couple minutes. I wrote to her and I said, like more like 90 seconds. I said that when I went to go get my order number, I must have lost the chance to get it. I must have just missed it. And she's like, huh. So she said she was looking into it and it's not a big deal. I'm not going to complain. You know, it is what it is. But that is how quickly it went. I really hope she's thrilled with that response because that's awesome. And if I get it, I get it. If I don't, I don't. Plain and simple, I was going to see if I could order because I did say I wanted both, but yeah, whatever. It happens, right? Okay, right. so let's open this baby up. I do like the fact that um, it's got little things here so that it can stand up. And that's nice. Okay, okay guys. <coughs> I don't know if my dog's in the kitchen chasing the cat or what. Yep, she is. Okay, so there are the colors there. Those are much prettier in person than I thought they were. This teal is a lot darker than I originally thought. So this palette will have a forever home in my, my collection. I do have the other pure Barbie one that I do ad adore. Um, I have it just for the sake of having it, plain and simple. I really wish I had thought to have collected the collection. Somebody was trying to tell me, like, it pure isn't all the greatest brand, but it does have some really nice stuff and um, I'm pretty thrilled with it. So I'm just gonna grab a couple extra brushes. Okay. Oh my lord. Wow. Does it say anything on the back? <laughs> the one is the one green is called Barista Ken. Okay. So it's not clothes. It works 
closed very well. Okay, so let's use this blending one. I think I'm gonna go in with Ooh, I really like this color here. Sorry guys, this color here. I know you guys can't really see that, but. Just, ah, uh, okay. So I am gonna go in with this like color right here. So it doesn't have the colors on, but I'm gonna use this. Huh. Okay, so this is Skipper. This one here is Skipper. So as you can see, there's a lot of fallout in the pan, but you know, a lot of palettes have that nowadays, so. I love the mirror on this, it's like so large. Like it's large. So this will just be like a transition color. Oh gosh, that is so pretty. You can Okay, I am going to go in with this color here. These brushes are really nice. And look at that color. My hand's starting to cramp. Not because of the palette, but because it's just supposed to be funny like that. Do you really need to be in the kitchen? No. Do you mind? Do you mind? I don't like when you do that. You know that. Yeah, I don't. Dogs and kids. Dogs and kids and kids. Up. Oh. <laughs> Gonna make your daily appearance, eh? Hey, Sash. Hey, and you say hi, world. I'm a superstar. Hey. Hmm. I love you. I don't know. I'm a girl. Okay, done. Thank you. Okay, so this one is Barbie style, and now I want to go in with Timeless, which is like the lipstick. I think I actually have this lipstick, but let me see here. Inspire and Legendary. Okay, so the timeless one is the one that uh, came broken. I still have it because, like, I can't get rid of it, but really, really, really wish they'd replace it for me. Okay, so. I am going up with timeless, so let's just... So this is going to be a longer video. So I'm just going to go in here and come out with it. She has her bone. Oops.
Okay. Let's see here. I think I'm going to go in with... Let's go in with this one. And this one is... Dream Doll. So this one here. Sorry guys. Hey here. I think I, used, I grabbed the wrong brushes. <laughs> I'm so excited that I'm not even paying attention to what I'm actually doing. And I'm not even using any freaking primer. Oh my gosh, Roxanne, pay attention. I don't care. Look at that. Oh my gosh, can you guys see that? Oh, it is gorgeous. It's like a purple. Pat it, pat it, pat it. This would probably look a lot better with primer, but you know, because this is going to take so long and I'm really not with it today. I kind of have to put the mirror down. I don't know why my hand is cramping, but. I put my brushes right behind. I'm not going to use all these brushes, but just, you know what? I don't know why. I'm... Okay. I'm going to go in with. This one might be better too with uh, my finger. Yep. It is so creamy. Can you guys see that? That is gorgeous. I don't know if you guys can see how well this is going on. I am blown away. Whoa. Okay, guys. Do you have? I don't know if you guys can see that or not. But oh, crap. Shut the front door. Whoa. I was not expecting that. Guys, like. Holy moly. I'm going to um, swatch these for you in a bit. Because I can't put them all in my eye right now. But I am going to say this, guys. If you like brushes, you need to get this brush out. I love the way that these feel. They're not cheap. They are a little light, which is nice. And this is not flimsy. It's not stuck on. It's actually right around. So it's like the top part of this. So, I mean, they obviously put some work into this. So I am using the color 
motivate under my eyes and I absolutely love this color it's like a brown purple like red in there I don't know it's just gorgeous and then I'm going to take this beautiful peachy called icon right here in the middle I don't know if you guys can see that I'm blown away like I don't know what else to tell you this is just absolutely amazing okay so before I go any further let's do some swatches here just kind of want to I'm going to do the the certain colors last just because I know they're going to be harder to get off my hand okay actually that's a lot because I want to go with this color first here Okay, so there's the first four colors. So let's see here. Okay, so. That I, I gotta use. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Okay, ready? Two, three, four. Ow! Okay, so we're Just wiping my hands off of my pants and they're clean and I shouldn't do that. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Okay, so let's I'm have to start down here. One, two, three, four. Those are gorgeous colors. Again. Okay, so one, two, three, four. So we have three colors left. Okay. Okay, so one, two, three. Okay. <laughs> have to put three up there whoa okay so the one looks a little patchy but it could be because it's in a small the small box here yeah, that's why and I wasn't able to grab as much as I should have but there you go like this is gorgeous this is gorgeous I like how it's kind of got a dark teal to it I don't know like you know me I don't usually Uh, what do I want to say here? I don't usually, um, do swatches because I'm like, oh, you guys will see the rest of the colors one day. Uh, you definitely will see the colors. So this, I have to admit, this is pretty, pretty good. Like, I don't really like it. I'm going to keep it, obviously. Um, okay, so 
let's go on to, I'm going to use Okay, so this is actually a pure, pure product too. This has got to be one of my favorite eyelash curlers. I know we're 30 minutes into this, guys, and you're like, holy crap. I haven't really stopped talking though, so that's good, right? Like, at least I'm keeping you entertained, right? At least I hope so. Anyway, I know you're supposed to keep it for two minutes, but you know what? We don't really want to do this for two minutes because I'm talking and you don't want to sit there while I'm doing this for two minutes. And I don't really want to edit it too much today. I want to get the nail polishes now, so I have to go on the hunt for those. I mean, I can order it from Pure's website, but they're not really curled, but you know what? We're going to use the It Cosmetics. Guys, I am like... blown away and I just want to mention that I did pay for this this is my money that I spent on this product while I expect it to be decent I do uh, enjoy Pure's products I just did not expect it to be that good um, I mean this pink is absolutely gorgeous. The nice thing is, is um, a lot of times I get it all the, up through here. I do have it a bit through here, but that could be because of the way I placed it. Um, and this side, it hasn't really moved, especially that darker color, which is really nice. Um, I did put that kind of shimmering pink under, and I was like, oh, it's not even gonna show up on me, but it is there, and I really, really like that dark color under my eyes. Yeah, and I absolutely love, 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 the eye brushes. I don't know if did I use any of these other ones. I think I did, didn't I? Maybe not. No. Okay. Well, I'm gonna put these ones back. Gotta wipe them in my way. All right. So one step at a time, Roxanne. One step at a time. Okay. Let's do some. Oh, you know what I didn't do. So I have this. And I'm going to use this. So this is the primer. I've been using it a lot lately and I've liked it. Although I think it's got some product from yesterday in it because yeah, yesterday was a mess. Okay. Okay guys, I'm going to stop it right there for just a minute. I got to go see what's going on. Okay. <laughs> So sorry about that. Okay, so I could have actually just done this while you guys were gone. While I was gone. Wow, I think actually that just made my eye brows a lot darker. Okay. So, you know, I wouldn't be able to buy some of this stuff today if I still had all of my subscriptions. So I'm really glad that I've canceled some of them. Whoa. My eyebrows look so much darker right now. Okay. So. Okay, guys. This is Malibu Blush. I know I just always unboxings, but I like I want you guys to see my face this time. <sighs> oh guys, it's sort of like getting a new car. Oh my I think. Hold on.
Oh, I didn't do it with the other one. Okay. Look at those. I have no more room on this arm, so, okay. Let's, one, two. <laughs> is there a toddler in the house? Yep, there is. Okay, one, two, three, four. Those are gorgeous. Okay, right, so I threw the whole thing in the garbage. Okay, so I think I'm going to actually use this purple here. I want to use it. That is really, really nice. I'm still kind of blown away. I know a lot of this will be collector's items for some people. I'm going to use mine. I mean, I might keep the packaging though. Okay, so the highlighter. Guys. I'm really surprised by the black blush. There's a purple blush in there and it's like the perfect shade for me. I absolutely love it. Okay, don't worry about that right now. I'm gonna use this. Okay guys. Definitely chalky. So that design might not be there forever. So maybe I'll have to Pick up a second one. Let's see. Hey, you don't need a whole lot. I'm not going to blow out anything from that because I want to keep those little particles. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we have these things left too. I'm going to open up the Innovator. I'm going to try the Innovator today.
Okay. So there's the color on the bottom and there's the color. So, I mean, that does match in the light pretty well, but when I see it, it's not the same color. I actually... Why did they not put lip liners for these? Like, I'm so nervous that I won't like this. I know that sounds so bad. Oh, I do like the fact that they kept it like that because that was one of the things I loved about the other one. Okay. That actually kind of suits me. Okay. All right. So. Hold on. Okay. Sorry guys, I just gotta see this quickly. Oh, hmm. okay. That's not what I thought it was gonna be. Look at that. Whoa. Okay, I will be using that because, you know, you gotta. Okay, so let's get on to this because I still have to do my Nani Knickers. You guys I haven't even done my Nani Knickers yet. Okay, 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 okay. Whoa, this is Girl Gloss. Watch, watch, watch. Okay. That was made for this lipstick. Okay, I'm not gonna put it on the top because I wanna see what the bottom is like. Or, I'm not gonna put it on the top because I wanna see what the bottom is like. I heard what I said.
I am so wearing this by itself. Okay, guys. I'm trying to screw it. Remember, it pops. Okay, so I didn't get much of the first collection. I'm really glad I got what I did of this collection. And I have to say, I'm absolutely thrilled with everything. Everything from the packaging to the colors to the payoff. Um, I can't believe how much... I really, really, really love this eyeshadow. I love the way I've applied it. I made it yesterday, like, look. I love the highlighter. I love the blush. This blush is going to be my go-to. I might have to go get a second one just so I have it. And as for the lipstick, it is perfect for me, I think. If I can wear this, can you? I really like this look. This has got to be one of my top looks that I have done, especially with the collection. Of course, the matte from the, the foundation is just, oh, it makes my skin look so good. You know, when you do something nice for yourself and you feel it, yesterday was such a crappy day. I was so upset. I want the, the setting spray so badly. Like I was just like, Wah. So yes, yeah, yesterday I was like that. So, okay guys. I I absolutely adore this set. I If I made commission, I probably would tell you to go out and buy it anyway. But because I'm not making any commission off of it, I'd still get crap a couple of pieces. You're not going to be disappointed. Okay, so I'm just going to open up all the undies now. So I did have to switch from a medium to a large, which really punishes your self-esteem but whatever it is what it is Ooh, okay those ones are cute not a big fan of my butt hanging out but you know what I like those okay so these ones are cute those ones are really really cute but I will tell you that once you wash these, these will shrink down a size. So definitely go a size up. You can always switch halfway or, you know, the next month. Um, okay, those ones are really, really cute. Oh, so, I mean, these, so Naughty Knickers is a subscription. I do love that they included a lot of pink this month, even though we're going into fall. Um, it kind of goes with my Barbie theme. That is kind of funny. Oh my gosh, it does, doesn't it? Like, you know, like. <laughs> my review of Barbie and Naughty Knickers. <laughs> okay, guys, Naughty Knickers is a Canadian-based underwear subscription. One pair is $3.99, I believe, or three pairs for like $11.99. It comes monthly, but the nice thing is when you sign up, um... Like, I signed up on the 13th, so it charges me the 13th of every month. I'm going to try and uh, arrange it so that it comes out on the 1st so I can get them uh, quicker. And, yeah. So, if you sign up using the link below, I won't get anything from it. But if you email them and let them know that I sent you, my email is in the description below as well. If you let them know that I sent you, I could get something. But maybe not. But at least it lets them know that uh, people are refer uh, um, are. I am referring people to it. So anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned. I have so much more coming, especially with this line. I'm going to try out another look, um, try out the other lipstick, the other lip glosses, well, the other lip gloss, and I'm going to see if I can find the other items to complete this collection. Okay, guys, have a great day, and please don't forget to like, share, and make sure you're subscribed.